What's up guys, this is One View, and after my first crash and burn with my first video, we're going to do a second video, why not? Uh, so with this video, we're going to do Gazul, Gazul the Astral Watcher, uh, or as I like to call him, the Eyeball of Fury. <laughs> this thing is nuts. Uh, this thing basically will wipe your raid out if you make too many mistakes, no matter how high level you are, how good you are, how good your gear is, doesn't matter. You have to follow the rules with this guy. Basically he's got four phases. He's got blue, red, green, and yellow. And you're only allowed to do certain attacks during each of the phases. So as a melee, the phases that I can attack in is blue, no, is red and green. I can use my bow in blue but it's just range bow, you can't use um, magical attacks or anything like that. And uh, during the red and green phases, I can just use my melee attacks, but no magic. So if I went in with a bow and used, um, you know, for example, Tesla shot, it's going to put a stack on him. And like I said, if you make too many mistakes, he gets stacks. If he gets 10 stacks, your entire raid is done for. So even though this is like a level 40, I think it's like a 47 instance now, it's not really end game. Uh, this is still difficult if you don't have the right coordination for your raid. So we're about to start this up. And we'll wait for the countdown. And then we'll go in and hopefully we get this on our first try, but it's no guarantees. This guy is nuts. <laughs> And he does decent damage, but it's, it's 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 not really the issue. It's the issue of your raid messing up. And uh, the biggest thing you want to worry about is if you have a pet. Pets seem to really mess this boss up. They go and attack. They like have a mind of their own. Start attacking during the wrong phases. Things like that. Uh, I should mention with the fourth phase, which is yellow, he spawns gargoyles and eyes. So I guess the method that we kind of use and uh, other people that do this is you pull all the gargoyles together and then you CC the eyes while you're killing the gargoyles. You keep the eyes CC'd so they don't kill your members one by one in the raid. Alright guys, and here we are. We're starting up. So we'll just watch the phases. We're in the blue phase. So you need to stay in the runic circle. This is what I'm on now. You can see that everybody's on there. Uh-oh. Alright, so he's at uh, he's at six stacks as you can see. <laughs> Somebody went in there, they weren't supposed to go in there. Alright, this might be a wipe, but we'll see, alright. Alright, so red phase, we're at, we're going in. Uh, usually I'll do a I'll do a crippling blow at the start just so I can deal the 10 second damage on him. I'll do it twice, but then after that I won't do it again in case you know the the time extends. All right, so we wiped on that one. Here we go, round two. All right, so blue phase, runic circle. We're on it. Now you can attack with your bow. But uh, if you don't feel comfortable doing that, you know, staying in the runic circle, not doing anything is fine. Like what I'm doing. So, I kind of like this boss a lot, you know, he's kind of like, he's an eye, he's got three eyes, chains broken all off his head, he's spitting out lava, I mean, it's just a cool looking boss, but as you've seen, he can wipe you. Alright, so green phase, we can do some damage here. Again, this is a melee phase, so you want to do any magic. So far he's got no stacks. The one thing about the green phase is he does poison you, so... So it might be a good idea to have some poison antidotes on you, or to make sure you have some beers to heal yourself. So yellow face, he's gonna spawn the uh, the gargoyles now. There they are. So they're gonna pull them to the door. They're gonna pull them to 
Which door? We're going to this door right here. And we can AoE them, doesn't matter what attacks you use, but you just want to AoE them and you want to kill these gargoyles. So he's in red phase, we can go in and attack. I'm doing pretty good this one. Looks like he doesn't have any stacks yet. It's always a good thing. He's at 50%. Still no stacks. Alright. And when you uh, you notice that is uh his buff runs out, kind of everything goes down. Okay, that's yellow. We're going gargoyles again. Usually, you want the least amount of yellows as you can if you're just doing this. So, let's get on these gargoyles again. Another gargoyle. So, we got a couple of. Back, so they have one of the ICCs CC'd. We're at green phase. We're going with poison. We at least can go in. Nice. Alright. Looks like he has a stack. But we're alright. I think we're alright. We're alright. We're pretty good. My house going down. I'm just gonna pop. Always good to have the Aqua Eternus, the beers. I'll just pop one of those. 21% one stack. Alright, so we're red phase again. We might be able to finish him here. Hopefully. Don't want to fail twice. <laughs> so again, if you just started out, your first time doing this, you just want to have a raid that kind of knows what they're doing, kind of can listen. Um, and he's really not that hard, but if you mess up, you're gonna die. You can expect a few wipes. Alright, looks like that's it. That's it. And he drops a demonic bo uh, box, which is the. It gives you the GT costume, which is uh, what I have on now. So, I'm gonna pass that. And that, that's it for Kazol. Thanks for watching. Next is the one and only Galuxor. He's a clone freak. He's got a bunch of clones locked away. <laughs> also, definitely a cool boss to check out. So, uh, tune in again. Thanks a lot, guys.